BTN Basketball presented by April Air comes to you from Value City Arena as the Buckeyes look to get back on track tonight against a UConn team that has won three of its last four. 34-point game earlier this year against Oklahoma State. 30 of those came in the second half alone as Micah Potter will do the honors of the jump against Amita Brima for UConn. And we are underway here in Columbus. The Buckeyes win the tip. Beat that zone, you either have to beat it with the pass or the dribble drive. Jump shot on the way and through for Jalen Adams. We'll call his name a lot. 18 points per game so far. Drive kick out. Cam, or Cam Williams loves to shoot in rhythm. Brima with his back to the basket against Micah Potter. The hook from Brima goes through. Of course, trying to save as much as he could. Jalen Adams around the defense. You see the talent of Adams on display there. He made threes, but all the threes came because he made plays for his teammates. That's the real zone killer. A pull up three from the top as Purvis drops it from the top of the arc. Cross court pass. Three on the way from Cam Williams. Doesn't fall. It was short. A rebound for Enoch. Cam's not getting that step into a shot. Love the Euro step. That's beautiful basketball. You can do. Well, Potter's got a couple of fouls. He's on the floor. He was on the floor, but now yeah. Trevor Thompson in the game, and it was Thompson. And we just watched Adams blow by him. Coming off the screen as it's set. Right here, if we freeze it. Right there. It gives him a straight line to the basket, forcing Loving to come off of his man, which is a shooter. And if he doesn't help, it leads to a wide-open layup. You have to force him. UConn beat Syracuse on Monday. You didn't see a real pretty basketball game. I haven't seen one quite yet here, but we have seen UConn stay close to Ohio State as the long two falls for Rodney Purvis. But Adams thought about it, took it in. The jump shot falls short. That's the first miss Adams has had. Turn around off the putback. And it was Kenton Facey with that pretty shot. The guy who's handled himself incredibly well. And you can't say enough about that. That's a challenge. I mean, as good time as he was. Vance Jackson for three. Was that off? Thompson tried to tip that back. Buckeyes two for ten from three-point range early on. Here's Vital. Got left alone as C.J. Jackson lost him on defense. Still only 28 years old. But has just been knocked over. As far as those knee problems are concerned, Vance Jackson with the nifty moves to tie the game. Lead headed to the locker room. Vance Jackson, two seconds left. Here's Jalen Adams, and UConn does take the lead at halftime. Someone can do that to you from, from time to time. It just kind of keeps you settling for shots. Even though you feel like you're open, you're not exactly as open as you think. It's Amita Brimo with the hook over Potter. The right kind of shot where you're catching in rhythm. Those are high percentage threes. Ohio State has six players that average in double figures as Vital makes a jump shot from the free throw line. It's Jalen Adams missing a rare miss. As Kenton Facey fights for the rebound and he goes right back to the hoop. Defense, you're in position, not moving the ball well. It's, look, it's this fight for the ball. One dribble, rise and throw down. Rebounding machine. He was unable to pull that one down, though. Potter got it, although it was taken away. And now Purvis is all alone underneath the basket. Substitution for Lions. The energy, the effort. Vital just getting after it. Gets two deflections on one play, throws ahead. The funniest thing about this possession was he's celebrating it. Kevin Ollie says, Get your butt back on defense. <laughs> they nearly had a steal there. It's Jalen Adams protecting it for UConn. Shot clock inside of five. Three goes up and down for Vance Jackson. There's not much you can do about that. <laughs> Sending that game to a fourth overtime. UConn ended up winning it with purpose. And the shot clock winded down. And the tip in for Brian. As the centers for UConn are wreaking havoc inside. It just shows you, too, you got to get a body. You can't just give them a free run for a road victory. And overall, trying for their fourth and five games. Jump shot from Purvis. And Rodney Purvis from three is blocked. Trevor Thompson got up. Shot clock winding down. That's Brima with the hook over Jay Sean Tate. We're tied again. It's a position. Start to close this game. Kenton Facey over Tate as he falls back to tie the game. 13th season for Thad Mata here at Ohio State. 
has been the most successful basketball coach they've ever had as Jalen Adams gets two plus the foul with 18 seconds left. So Jalen Adams has a chance for a three-point play. So what that look? Again, I, I made fun of you for Captain Obvious. The one thing you don't want to do, you can't let him split and find a way to get a shot out. And if you are going to foul, you have to make him earn every bit of it. You can't even let him get that up to the rim. 